go to Christmas movies. I've been on a. Did I tell you I wrote down every TV show Christmas and then uh, basically every Christmas movie and I put them on a wheel and I just randomly spin it, whatever it lands on, I just watch. So I crushed yeah. all the TV shows. This is That's from pretty, like yeah. Phil the Future, Sweet Life of Zach and Cody. Then you got, oh, there's wow. like one curb your enthusiasm christmas episode there's uh we did the always sunny christmas that was great oh my God, that's so funny i have a huge list it was 36 tv episodes we that's did all the good. office all parks and rec and now i'm trying to like save my favorite movies for like the end like uh my top five like i'm trying to wait kind of closer to christmas christmas mm-hmm. story National Lampoon, National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation. But I think one, and, yeah, I think one and two are a lock for a lot of people. Oh, yeah. Right, Christmas Story, Christmas Vacation are people's one and two, like a lot. So let's yeah. like put those aside. Now I really think like three through ten can be negotiated. <laughs> Very for negotiated. sure. What do you put? What are you going three through five? What, what's your next three? Uh, I'd have to say like Elf. Home Alone. Uh, what would be my other one? Okay, so I'd put Home Alone in my top five for sure. Elf may, for me, may sit in the six through ten region. Yeah. Right? Because, like, classic. you have, well, you have classics like Miracle on 34th Street, right? Yeah, but is that your top five? Like, I watched that once in A Blue Moon. Okay, what about, like, uh, I'm trying to think of what are the other ones. Here, let me get a list. You know what one of my sleeper favorites is? What? I'll tell you what one of my sleeper favorites Let is. Me tell you all the Christmas See if you can stuff. guess it. What? Let me get my wheel up and I'll show you what I got. I had to punch this in manual. Oh, my God. Okay, so we've missed so many. <clears throat> So there are 34 TV episodes. Okay, we're not on TV. We're on the movie stuff, oh, right? And for movies, there are 39 Christmas movies. Oh my god! Okay, so we've missed some big ones. Obviously, one of my I'll tell you what. Well, my there's sleeper, like the it's kind of bullshit because there's like Home Alone, Home Alone Two. <laughs> No, Home Alone 2, but Home Alone 2 is a good Christmas film, but it's, Home Alone 2 is definitely 10 through 15. Yeah. Absolutely. It's not, home, the first one's my favorite. The first Home Alone I put in my top five for Christmas films, for sure. Yeah, that's a top five. I'll tell you my sleeper hit. Ready what? for my sleeper hit? Four Christmases. Yeah, that's Based a great one. On Reese we watched that one. Ruthless. That's a good one. Yeah. We missed a huge one that may be in my top five. Uh, Daddy's Home. Oh, yeah, no, the Daddy's Grinch is... Home, it, the Daddy's Home is, like, number 20. That's Grinch, a funny Christmas def- movie. Grinch is definitely... Grinch animated or real? Grinch with Jim Carrey. Jim Carrey, yeah, much better. That may be my number six. That could be number five, because that's such a great... Jim Carrey's performance as the Grinch is unbelievable. Right. You got a lot of, like, little ones out here, like the office Christmas party, the night before Christmas, the holiday, right? Like. Yeah, the night before Christmas, I also... That's like a Halloween movie to me, too. Is, what about the movie? How about this? What about the movie? It, this uh, do you put this movie in Christmas movie or not? Are you ready? Die Here's hard. A good one. Nope, not Die Hard. That's what everyone says. This is the sleeper question. Do you put this movie? Ready? Just friends. Yeah. Brian Christmas Reynolds. movie. Christmas movie or non Christmas movie? It is. We watched it. It's part of our list. Yeah. It because it. Uh, it happens around the holiday. It happens on Christmas, yeah, right around that. It's very yeah. subtle. 
But oh my God, Anna Ferris as the singer is the best part. Ashton, Ashton, I we watched oh that. God. Are we getting punked right now? I love when they walk into the bar and she goes, "Yes, I know, I know." Okay, okay. <laughs> he goes, "Let's just There's get it to go." Yeah, let's just get it to go. People are staring. <laughs> no one's looking. <laughs> no. Uh, well, the container said microwavable. Yeah, but the aluminum's not. <laughs> I can't do this. I, that's way too much on me. <laughs> oh, you know, another sleeper one. Another sleeper one is the one, the animated one, uh, the Polar Express. Yeah, that's a good one. But I, I don't, it's not one of my favorites, actually. Really? Just okay. Are you, putting, are you dropping it below 10? Maybe, it's, bu- it's a it's a bubble. It's on the bubble. It's, bu- it's on the bubble. It's a bubble movie. Yeah, it's a bubble movie. Because it, it does... Of- I do love the book. Hey, not a big fan of the movie. Yeah. Oh, Edward Scissorhands. Yeah. It also happens around Christmas time. But kind of more of a Halloween-y thing. Um... Oh my God! How did we miss this one? Fucking Santa Claus with Tim Allen. Yeah, that's a good one. He's got that's like three. one of my. That's one of my sleeper faves. Um, the also, first one, numbers two and three are get a the Arnold hug. Schwarzenegger one. Um, Jingle all the way. Yeah, with that's an old one. Yeah. Yeah. That's um, a good. One. Uh, let's see. There's so many. Oh, we counted Harry Potter because it is the first one's kind of Christmassy. It's kind of, it has a Christmassy feel. Number one, it does, there is there, a, yeah, doesn't, isn't there a section where it's around the holidays? Like the and first one came out that. like in December, and it's like a lot of it's kind of right around, they have a lot of winter scenes. That's what I'm saying, yeah. Um, do you count The Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe? Because uh, we watched that one. The Narnia? I mean, I don't know if I count it as Christmassy. I, it's definitely oh, in that no. like, it's, wintry it's based, Wonder World. Because that's kind of what that wintry Wonder World is, Christmas. I mean, I don't know if it's Christmas, but... Do you count Paul Blart, Mall Cop, as a Christmas movie? <laughs> definitely not. Because <laughs> <laughs> it is. It's on the Christmas list. Definitely, Paul Blart is where I draw the line. Paul okay, Blart Mall yes, Cop yes. is a Christmas movie. I'm drawing movie. the line at Paul Blart. Does not I'm telling you. Christmas store. I'm telling you, it's a Christmas movie. I love movie. You, Kevin James, and I love your work, but Paul Blart does not get into the Christmas store. That's where I'm drawing the line. I'm ta- Google said it was a Christmas movie. Look, you want to throw Die Hard in there? I'm all for it. What Just about... Friends? Absolutely. Paul what... Blart... Get out. What about why him, with James Franco as the uh, the who proposes to the Definitely guy? Definitely not. Definitely that's a, not. That's a Christmas movie. No. Also, get out the door. What about Hook? Get, you're getting thrown out by the bouncer. Uh, what about Hook? Ooh. Hook happens around right around Christmas. Man, I don't I know. I put it on Hook the list. Get in just because I just because I'm biased and I love that movie and I love Robin Williams, they may get in. <laughs> so Hook's on my list for Christmas. Hook movies. can get in. Yeah, Hook can get in. Uh, Scrooge. Scrooge or Scrooge? Yeah. Scrooge with, with, with uh, what's his face there from Bill Murray. Ghostbusters? Yeah, Bill Murray. Yeah, Bill Murray. Yeah, that's really good. Yeah, that's funny. Yeah, but where's that sit for you? For me personally, it's going to hit the 10 to 20 range. What about the office Christmas party? Also, I thought it was really funny, but also is going to hit in my 10 to 20 range. I love that comedian. What's his name? Something Miller? TJ Miller? Yeah, TJ Miller, yeah. He's so fucking funny. He got in a little trouble a while back for something i forget what it was but 
do you like? Where does Christmas with the Cranks sit for you? Yeah, it's going to be 15 through 20 for me. Yeah, I like it. Low. It's good, but it's it's going to sit. There's so many other good ones. Daddy's Home too. That's not even in my... That's not... For me, that's I put that up pretty high problem. just because it's hilarious. Uh, yeah. <laughs> it's Christmas. I can't I'm not believe... a big Wahlberg guy. Oh, because of the documentary and him being so soft? I mean, there's all that, but I'm just not a big fan of his acting, personally. Um, Bad Mom Christmas? Bad Moms? I, no, I haven't seen that movie at all, period, so I can't really. Neither have I, but it's a Christmas movie. Yeah. It's on the list. On the Last list. Holiday? Last holiday, I'd say the holiday is more than last holiday. But the holiday with Jack Black. 